to every spirit of the grave that has been calling anyone in the name of Jesus using dreams using prophetic experiences for some of you the devil is planning that you will not see December 31st that it is this year everything will end up with you in the name of Jesus by the power that raised Christ from the dead we decree and declare death has no power over you death has no power over you hallelujah now lay your hands I want to pray for the sick many people came here because you have heard that Jesus heals sadly we have to work with time I'm not sure we may even have the time to take testimonies because we still have to pray over our requests but I want you to lay your hands it is true that Jesus heals no distraction please lay your hands there if it's a part of your body you can touch make contact with it some of you are standing in for your children your loved ones don't let the devil destroy them lay your hands if it's a part of your body you cannot touch just make contact with your chest for I'm seeing people holding photos of people holding phones I'm sure others are connecting from across the globe there are many many people who connect from hospitals with their loved ones some in ICU some at emergency rooms now is the time to pray. You are my hiding place. You always fill my heart with songs of deliverance. Whenever I am afraid, I will trust in you. I will trust in you. Let the weak say I am strong in the strength. You sent your word and it healed my disease. You are the Lord, my healer. I want to pray. I am a product of the healing power of Jesus myself. I know that he heals. If you ever doubt that Jesus performs miracles, look at a living miracle standing before you. I know he heals. I'm about to pray now. This is one of the graces and the privileges God has given us as a ministry to bring as a gift to the body of Christ and across the nations of the earth. Those outside, all the overflows, now is your time to receive. He's a healing Jesus. As I pray for you, I want you to shout a loud amen. In the name of Jesus Christ. The Lord is telling me about someone you quietly met a doctor and the doctor told you that something is growing in your body you have not shared this with anybody but that you need to pray you are a man he told you you are beginning to have symptoms of prostrate because you went because of some abnormalities you, are, you began to see in your body and you went to meet the doctor and just on telling him, he could almost say, but he did some preliminary test, a test and he came to the conclusion that you are beginning to have the symptoms of an enlarged prostrate. You have not shared this with people. I want you to believe Jesus is about to heal. Every spirit that is back of any infirmity here represented in this auditorium over the life of your precious loved ones over the life of our global family and as many who are connecting right now across the body of christ in the name of jesus in this atmosphere of intense worship and faith i'm declaring to you by the power that raised christ from the dead that the spirit that is back of this we command judgment on that spirit now
and I decree and declare, my God, I'm seeing fire enter the chest of people, like literally entering inside. I decree and declare, be healed now. Be healed now. Outside, I decree and declare, lift your hands, the overflow outside. By the power that raised Christ from the dead, we see you from here. Be healed now. All other overflows in the name of Jesus, the Lord is with you right there. But I decree and declare by the power of the Holy Spirit, migraine headaches be healed. HIV be healed. Prostrate be healed. There is a lady, you have a disease. This is something that is common with women. And it has become an embarrassment to you. Many, many times. In the name of Jesus, the Lord is healing you right now. The Lord is touching someone's right ear. Be healed right now. I'm seeing someone, you can walk. But you are already beginning to have severe joint pains almost everywhere you know like it happens to a sickler in the name of jesus be healed now every dead or dying kidney jacks back to life now for someone having a failed liver god gives you brand new liver now I command eyes that are blind partially or totally to be opened now. Bone conditions be healed now. The Lord is showing me a vision that is quite embarrassing. I'm seeing someone, you're going to ease yourself in the toilet and what is coming out is not just stool that you are passing this is something related to pile it's almost like you know it, there are projections from within you coming out that you have to push back i'm sorry for sounding graphic but this is what the lord is showing me i don't know who that person is but in the name of jesus i declare that pile it dies now I'm sorry to say it and don't feel embarrassed, but I'm seeing at least, it is not less than 17 ladies here having multiple lumps. Multiple lumps. I don't know what is this thing that the devil is doing in this end time with women that is just plaguing them with lumps and growths. Our dear sisters, we are praying for you in the name of Jesus. Any spirit that wants to spy upon your liberty, because of your wombs that must carry the prophets, the apostles, and those who will herald the move of God, even in their young age, we declare those demonic growths live now. Yeah. Hallelujah. I'm praying for someone, I don't know what it is, I'm seeing around your neck here, very stiffness and severe swelling. The power of God is coming upon you right now. Yeah. In the name of Jesus. Yeah. Now, please don't be embarrassed, but how many people here came here trusting God for the fruit of the womb? The fruit of the womb. The fruit of the womb now i i know that there might be several people but i don't know how we're going to do this the lord has given me an instruction to i don't lay hands carelessly no i don't you don't see me lay hands on people carelessly but if and when god grants the grace to do i understand the power and the value of laying on of hands as a doctrine i don't know please only those no standing for anyone you are, and then you must be married. Two things. Make sure you, you can believe what you want to believe, but within 
what we are doing please there's nothing to be embarrassed about are we together so you meet these two conditions you are standing for yourself i want you to come while that is happening quickly please sit down for a minute and i want you to write start writing your prayer request right now please come and stand quickly i want to pray for you just one minute i'm going to touch you and that will be the end of it Are you standing for yourself? The devil is a liar. We are praying for them because these are the people bringing the next generation of koinonia. The devil is a liar. For in the sanctuary, God. a stillness in the atmosphere ah. oh come lay down the burdens you have carried for in the sanctuary I don't know how we're going to do this now because make sure you are writing your prayer request the Lord gave me a special instruction on those prayer requests tonight. And if you need to call your loved ones and have it down, those following online, here is your chance to do that quickly. Please, no standing in for someone. My dear, look at me. This lady, wait, lifting her hands. Shout Jesus as loud as you can. Jesus! Jesus! The name of Jesus Christ. Now, please hear me. There are so many people and I have to obey what God has said, but my God, can you imagine how many people? You see what the devil is doing to families? You will be changed. His glory will be revealed when the Spirit takes over your soul. Truly you will be changed His glory will be revealed When the Spirit takes over your soul We'll leave it from here As many, those who, those who are at the door there will just stop there All others can just stand by faith I don't know how we're going to do it I'm, I'm first going to pray Barrenness is a spirit You'll soon see it happen Barrenness is not just a case of not taking in. Now I want to pray. Believers, some of you are ministers. Let me teach you how to minister fruitfulness. It's not just about laying hands and saying, no, there is a spirit that is largely behind it. Those of you in front, lift your hands. Let me first cast out that spirit. And then you will be surprised. I'm going to pray and then we'll make it quickly. While that is happening... Please, ushers, you can be passing the prayer request as soon as I pray the prayer request so that we'll, we'll, we'll put it now. Father, in the name of Jesus, every legal access, I speak to these spirits, this is the house of God. Right now, at the count of three, the spirits that are responsible for barrenness, right now, I don't care what gave you legal access. At the count of three, it is time for God's people to be fruitful. One, Two, three, go, 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 go now, go now, go now, go now, go now, barrenness, go now, manifesting as impotency, manifesting as the inability to, to be with child, go now. Every legal access the devil has over you, your family, and every covenant that authorizes Satan by the blood of the eternal covenant, be free now. Hallelujah.
Now watch this. Here's what will happen. Just, just stay where you are. While we are collecting the prayer request, I am going to be very, very fast. Just a touch. You don't need to tell me anything. Just a touch and you go back to your seat rejoicing. Let there be no chaos. I have to obey what God has told me. It will be very, very fast. I don't lay hands carelessly, but we'll do this by the Spirit. In the name of Jesus. 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 By the power of the Holy Spirit. The name of Jesus. The next set, please. Very quickly. In the name of Jesus. By the power of the Holy Spirit. In the name of Jesus Christ. Please, as I lay hands on you, just be on your way so you clear the way for others. In the name of Jesus, return back with your miracle by the anointing of the Holy Spirit. Don't worry, as they reduce, we'll get more space. Just be patient. In the name of Jesus Christ, by the power of the Holy Spirit, in the name of Jesus Christ, in the name of Jesus Christ, in the name of Jesus Christ, we declare that it is done, even by the Spirit, please. In the name of Jesus, please. Once I pray for them, let the next set come, please. In the name of Jesus Christ. He touched me. Jesus touched me. And oh, what joy fills my heart. Something happened. Lord 